After carrying the book, it becomes clear that it is the memoirs of the Weissman and it says that he must never trust humans so much, or instead he must understand them much more, don't show them your true power they will fear you, and never try to be the best they will also hate you, just be normal like them and the memoirs talks to Yuya, saying he don't have magic vines because he is not from this world, so the memoirs gave him the Weissman magic power. Magic is easy to use just imagine the shape of magic then push it a little Yuya did a great job learning magic he goes back to the normal world where he go out with friends just to face a disaster forced him to use his new magic power to protect his friends. By covering himself with water magic he can make sure that fire won't hurt him or his friends and by using wind magic can also let them breath to save them in the end but dangering his identity. In the other world a rabbit faces a girl with sacred arrows power, and saying after the fight he must find the great student who will help him and hold his powers. Yua returns the other world to train more with his dog knight but finds a girl under attack so he tries to help her even when the danger is great. But his weapons are greater helps him to do incredible damage he lifts the girl out of danger, but knight is not in relaxed mode around her. After she wakes Yuya gave her the healing drink to heal her wounds and offers her a good hot bath with his bath items. After the bath the girl reveal that her name is Luna and she train in this jungle so why they don't help each other with training. And so like the days passed Yuya learned things about her and she learned him some techniques. But in the end Yuya must leave for his school trip. She tries to seduce him to stay with her but he just can't do that after returning to the trip. Yuya goes with Kaidi to get some fish where he used new Luna technique he must see the prey path. And with that he got so much fish. After getting some fish it's time to cook but the only one here with cooking skills is Yuya So. The chief is well known but first they must meet their teacher. Who just won the prize for the best teacher in this trip because her team Aka Yuya team got perfect score in survival skills. She asks them to do more good things and she will reward them later with some good surprises. Yuya cooks the fish with some mushroom and the result was epic the food was unrealistic to the point his teacher asked him to marry her and cook for her until the end of their lives but Kaidi won't allow that happen after the dinner he return home with teleport magic to feed night. Then return to the trip where he scare everyone with his muscles. In the next day they discover footprints of a bear, and badly they met the bear just to start running out of death. The idiots led the bear towards other people camps just how smart they are. Again to protect his loved ones Yuya slam the ground with the bear and knock him out without hurting anyone after this accident. He returned to meet the princess and her knights but mysterious killer tried to assassinate Lexia, but Yuya was there to stop him who turns out she is Luna. He carry her to his home and explain everything to Lexia. When Yuya tells Lexia about everything she understand but in the end she wanna know who is Luna for real. So she asks her after she wakes she tells the truth that she is an orphan who trained by the dark guild to be an assassin, but she failed to kill the princess so the guild now will hunt her. Lexia tells her that she no longer need to be a killer she can be a guardian so why don't she just protect her. But she refused because she already killed so many people she don't deserve to live. But Yuya and Lexia made her change to be better. While bathing Lexia told her she will never let Yuya with her she will get him no matter the cost. In the end they returned home with saying just come to visit the king is waiting for you. After this adventure Yuya meet his new family member Hojo. A pig with power or buff make allies stronger and heal faster. The CEO who was interested in Yuya because of the last photo shoot asks Yuya to join her company as model. And he just said, no I don't wanna. Because Yuya want to enjoy his school normal life as possible. She asked Mio for help but Yuya don't wanna be a model. She thinks and thinks just to find out that there is a festival in the school. She will shoot some picture for him while he plays some games. Yuya return other world to face new monster crystal pig and he was strong enemy almost killed Yuya if the rabbit didn't help him. Then the rabbit found Yuya interesting just to say that Yuya will learn his skills and hold his name the best kicker in the world and fight curse power users after long training. The master explained that sacreds like him must protect the planet with their power against curse so keep up the training to our next meet. After all those words Yuya returned to the festival just to break record in every game he plays making good photos and more important making some new feelings. The CEO is happy with photos, while Yuya is not happy at all. His grades are bad and to raise them he asks help from Kaori who can't wait to visit his house. While studying Kaori find out about the door who connect this world forcing Yuya to explain everything to her. She enjoyed the truth and wanted to discover the world so bad but she can't. This world outside the house zone is danger and she might die. Yuya beg her to keep this just for the two of them. Secret for just the two of them made her day all long. After that Yuya go to the city for first time to trade some things and find the path to royal capital to meet the king who almost killed Luna. Because he heard she tried to kill his lovely girl. Meanwhile the blonde boy who is the prince is not taking things easy. 
he sent Assassin to take his father and sister but Yuya was there and helped them with his mighty power. After the attack the knights ask Yuya's help to catch the prince and he says yes. So he goes on date with the princess and Luna until they can track the prince. About some time they find him so they go to catch him. But Yuya feels like he know the prince so much because he reminds him of himself back then when he was fat, ugly and no one love him. But Yuya must stop this madness. The girl of sacred arrows appear and start fighting them but she can't do much because she's tired. And to fight Yuya and win she must use dark power so she warns him the next time won't be easy. Now the prince is ready for judge. But he said that everything happened to him all those scars are because of his little beloved sister. In the past she used her magic but the mana wasn't stable and to protect her he got injured in his body and mind. The berserk magic mana made him crazy. And craving for blood and kill without forgetting his body scars. Yuya feels bad for him so he tries to give him medicine cure everything. And yes he got better in both physical and psychological states, but Yuya can't rest even now. The girl who used the evil power out somewhere and she warned him she will return so he started training. Out of nowhere he got attacked by the girl. The two clashed but Yuya is weaker than her after some time. Kaori enter the world to make things worse for Yuya now he must fight and protect. In the end he got big help from his master the rabbit to finish the girl. And he asked her why she turned this way because he know her master he was his friend. She say the humans betrayed her master after protecting them for too long so they deserve death. But Yuya ask her to give humans the chance by inviting her to see the world how he does. And this is the end for the first season.